what's poppin' YouTube, it's your boy Who's Mans. You already know what time it is. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and that bell so you never miss an upload. And like I said, I'm bringing you these Boo Boo Browns gameplay. I'm playing against the Ravens. We about to get into it. First and 10, my opponent. Looks like he wants to establish the run. I'm not even gonna say I have run D, but you know, I know what's supposed to stop the inside runs. Uh, right here, he does a nice little play action. Give me that. Throws it directly at me. I don't know what you're looking at, but you may need some glasses. You get juked out your shoes. Fall down. We're going to score. Go up early. 7 nothing. We need this because the Browns is straight garbage. And, I mean, look, if you like the Browns, you like the Browns. I'm not going to fault you. Right now, my Steelers are playing. Big Ben is stressing me out as he throws. Ooh, wow. Deontay Johnson just caught a... Okay, anyway, we getting back to the game because they're playing the Broncos right now. Anyway, um, my opponent is trying to run the ball. I set up for stretch D. He tries to run it up the middle. We stop him right there. You already know what it is, man. We're, we're just going to try to do this. And look, I get it. I get it. You know, Hollywood Brown fast, okay? But that's Denzel Ward. Even though I don't like the Browns, I can respect it. Denzel Ward's from Ohio State, okay? You got to respect the Buckeyes. It's first and 10. We're going to throw this in route to uh, old Poopy Man himself right there. <laughs> Let me stop, man. You know, he already get, he under, under fire, man. He's a good wide receiver. But, um, yeah, we throw a nice little screen here to Kareem Hunt. Try to pick up some yardage. Pick up some good yards right there. Um, It's going to be third and six. And if you're going to give me that, I'm going to take it. We throw it to Juice right there and pick up the first down. Um, something that I've noticed that you're going to notice is my man keeps playing cover three and I'm going to play this, um, style, uh, or that, not this style, but this, uh, scheme, um, on offense to stop him. And right here, my wife calls me and I wasn't paying attention. So I'm going to blame my wife on this one because I would not have done that and I wouldn't have thrown his pick six right here. So now my opponent back in the game. All right, I'm mad at myself, and I'm kind of mad at my wife. I'm not going to hold it to her. You know, she's my wife. She wants to call me. She wants to talk to me. It's cool. You know what? Let me calm down. This dude I ain't been making good reads all game. So I'm going to take it like it is. He's going to kick the ball off to me. Deep. That's cool. You know, I haven't returned a kick for a touchdown yet anyway. It's whatever. First and 10. Do a play action. He keeps running cover three. I'm going to keep running this play. This is a good type of play. It's something that you can do with um, any quarterback. Um, you can set up that route combination. It makes that uh, linebacker over there have to decide whether to guard the streak, the flat, or that deep end. Usually, they're going to choose that um, flat or the streak, and it's going to leave them flat-footed. As you see again, run cover three. I'm going to keep running this play. And right there, you see, Fort gets caught trying to guard either that flat or that, that streak. And uh, like I said, it's a good combination. And right there, Nick Chubb. Nick Chubb over there running hard. I see that, you know, hey, he can't handle this run somehow. Chubb gets the first down. I thought that was a touchdown, but nah. I sneak in Kareem Hunt at fullback. Do a fullback dive. Get the touchdown. We go a 14 to Selm. And something I noticed that kind of helps with field goals on this is if you wait at least like four seconds, the kick meter doesn't lag, or at least hasn't lagged for me when I wait. So I don't know if that's something y'all want to do or, or try, but so far it hasn't done it for me on or offline. Uh, first and 10, my opponent throws a nice little dot there. I sagged off and uh, you know, I paid for it. Um, it's going to be second down and really, I, he threw it directly at me and I decided to move. I mean, that's one good thing that I like about this game is that when you make a decision to move from a spot, you can't just like stop and then sprint back to it. Like, look, I made the wrong decision and I paid for it. I could have, you know, had the, you know, touchdown right there, not the touchdown, but the interception, but I didn't right there. I did make a correct read. And I bit down on that right there. I, as you see, I took, you know, I, uh, I, I should decided to sit there and didn't put up a spy. And he beats me underneath right there. It's first and ten. He throws a pass. Denzel Ward breaks it up. Denzel Ward doing a good job. I can always admit when somebody's doing good. Denzel Ward is locking him down right now, and I love it. 
Uh, it's going to be third and 10. He throws a screen. I didn't even see that. Usually, I always check the running back because that's normally the first uh, assignment I have if I'm playing uh, linebacker. But I didn't. I didn't take advantage of it. And a, hey, it is what it is. Right there, he picks up the fourth down. I got to bite down on this, man. It's 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 getting late in the second uh, second half. He decides to run. I did send the spy, but for some reason it made my guy fall. I don't know why. Um, don't throw it. Don't throw it over there. I. I'm I'm getting tired too of the automatic. Um, run back by the uh cp or the yeah the cpu basically when you pick the ball off it's pissing me off right here i get sacked so i'm just gonna run the ball and you know in the half i tried to hurry up and get in a field goal position and you know pick up some good yards or get a field goal at least go up 17 7 doesn't happen but i end up getting this ball back it's gonna be i gotta tighten up on the second half and uh, see see what we can do here. I get this ball. Can I get my first kickoff return? No, it ain't happening today. Especially not with Dookie LeBrown's right here. Um, Nick Chubb running hard. You know, I'm trying to get him involved in the game. I just want him to definitely get going on the offensive side because the Browns for some reason just they haven't. I don't know. Or they just don't use Nick Chubb right here. I forced it up. I. Hey, it was third and four. I don't know. I pushed it down that far. Fourth and four. Can I pick it up? He runs cover three again. I mean, hey, you going to run cover three? I'm going to take it. It is what it is. It's going to be first and ten for me. Hand the ball off with Nick Chubb. We pick up a considerable amount of yards on the ground. As you see, we got six rushes for 29 yards. Nick Chubb is doing a great job right here. Hey, this is something only the Browns would do. 77, who are you trying to block? What are you trying to do? Nobody knows. Uh, we do a play action here. Dude, cover three. He keeps running cover three or man. And that play is good just because. Um, Oh, wow. The steal. Oh, wow. Okay. I need to stop watching this game. Anyway. Um, Odell Beckham is good enough of a route runner to get a little bit of separation, especially on those routes. And right here, I... You, I hit the button a little late. I'm, I'm glad that he didn't react to it. I should have thrown it a smidge earlier as, wow. I had to change direction right there because Kalias Campbell came in there smoking. But I get up to get the touchdown. We go up 21-7 as Nick Chubb gets the touchdown there. I wanted him to get at least one touchdown. And we just we got that, you know. As I feel like the Browns are best when you when you get the, the offense or the defense to commit to the run to Nick Chubb. Um, right here, my opponent decides to come out five wide, and once again, this is something only the Browns could do. I, I played a uh, cover four palms. I backed him up, played over the top, and he still got burnt, and it wasn't even Hollywood Browns. So now it's 14-21. Fourth quarter just starts. I got to come out and score again because the Browns are so trash. I mean, it, like I said, if, you, if you're a Browns fan, it is what it is. I, I'll give you all this. Y'all loyal, and y'all are seriously one of the best fans, even when, uh, you know, going to a Browns game, because I live in Ohio. Even when you go to a Browns game and you're not a Browns fan, I can appreciate that y'all y'all cheering from start to finish, that y'all doing that. I can The Bengals, no. The Bengals game that I went to, Bengals fans is trash. They don't, they don't, they don't cheer. Right here, I see that uh, Humphrey was, was pressing, and I know that uh, <laughs> Odell Beckham is fast, but somehow I get bailed out. I ain't even gonna lie right there. I got bailed it, bailed out, and you know sometimes that happens. And oh lord, what is going on? Deontay Johnson is giving me a heart attack. Let me stop watching this. We do a quarterback run right here with Baker Mayfield, and he's feeling dangerous. He's getting out the pocket, feeling getting the first down. Get out of bounds, you know, because we don't want him to get smacked up. And Nick Chubb just getting them hard, dirty yards right there. And uh, we're going to put Kareem Hunt back in at fullback. You already know what time it is. And he runs that defensive lineman over to get the touchdown. So we're going up 28 to 14. We up two scores. Okay. Can the Browns please do something? All right. Because I'm putting y'all in position, okay? You know, I'm putting y'all in position. Can y'all just not be like the Browns? That's all I'm asking. We playing against the Ravens, you know what I mean? 
We already had a disadvantage. Once again, Denzel Ward doing a good job on Hollywood. But Denzel Ward's the only one right now that I, I like right now. Not even the, the, the man, the myth, the legend smacking people in the helmet. And right here, fam. Once again, I switch on. I hit Y because he's a Browns player. He don't even want to go up and 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 at least smack the ball so we get scored on. It could have been 28-14, my ball, and 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 doesn't want to do it. Doesn't 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 even care. Doesn't want. Doesn't. I mean, look, bro. This is this is the last game I'm playing with the Browns right here because nothing was going right. But, you know, giving the ball to Nick Chubb. Let's just run this quarter out. Calais Campbell, hey, I can't be mad as Calais Campbell. He's just too good. Right here, he finally changed it up. Put that man right there. I didn't notice it until late. So I got to punt the ball. And then I got, I'm just like, man, are you serious? 28-20. Uh, All right, man. So he throws this here. Wilson, or is that, no, that was Ward, I'm pretty sure. Ward smacks that out right here. W Joseph, what are you doing? He's the only person in your area, and you don't even try to, like, guard him. It's the round. So I'm like, man, I can already see this going on. Right here, I tried to stop Wilson from that. He just does a four verts. We stopped that pretty well. Let me back them up because I know they're going to get burnt. And, uh, yeah, anyway, it's going to be second and 16 in... Denzel Ward gives that up on the inside. That's cool. I just don't want him getting anything on the outside. He decides to throw this deep. Two players, nobody can pick it off. Cool. Y'all don't want to win. Y'all have no heart. It's it's whatever. It's the Browns. There, Hollywood Brown once again catches it on the inside. But can they have? Can they get to snap it in time? No, they cannot. The clock saved me because the Browns were not. <sighs> This was the most stressful in second half of my life because the Browns are garbage. You know, I'm not trying to slander nobody, but the Browns are garbage. And they definitely made it harder on me. I've had them in position to just seal this game away, and they didn't want to do it. Um, I'm, I'm going to partially blame EA, but I'm mainly bl blaming the Browns because they're just the Browns. That's what the Browns do. And, uh, I mean, it is what it is. But anyway... That's going to be the end of the game. I'm going to show you all some of these stats. As I try to keep it balanced. Um, I'm pretty sure I had over 100 yards of um, passing, 100 yards of running. Um, something that I wanted to do. And it worked out in my favor. <sighs> but anyway, I got some more gameplay coming. I'm going to play with them sorry little Bengals next. And, um, yeah, I need to get these trash teams out of the way. Just finish up with these Bengals is yeah you see 159 in the air 115 on the ground three takeaways Chubb had 77 and a touchdown and you want to see Odell had 104 but uh yeah thank y'all for watching peace <laughs>